you doing guys? We're here at Downtown Disney today. It's been a while since we've been here. It looks like they added some new things and we really want to show you guys what they have right now. It's been a while for us. So we're going to learn and figure out together what's going on yes, here. Yes, they have some food trucks and it looks like Soulfully just started because some experiences is happening on the Ooh, stage right beautiful now. Beautiful music. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to show you guys. So why don't you join us today on this Magic Journeys. Here we go. Yeah, so right now at the ESPN Zone building, it looks like they have the Soul of Jazz, an American adventure and it's open daily from 12 p.m to 8 p.m. if you guys want to check it out it's right over here at the ESPN building we need to go see what's going on in there look at the mural Whoa! the Main Street electrical parade mural right now you can go inside of Disneyland and check it out for yourself they're celebrating 50 years that's pretty cool. <laughs> <I know. laughs> They've been using the ESPN zone for a lot of different things. This used to be the ESPN zone building. They've used it for merch, for merch releases, I guess you could say. Uh, they've yeah, used photo it for ops. photo ops. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when they used to have that Mickey, what was it? It was what like it was. a Mickey photo thing. It was literally just for like a bunch of like <laughs> photos. It was actually pretty cool. We took some great photos, but now they have the soul of jazz. Look. Very cool. <laughs> over to downtown Disney you could check out the soul of jazz it's a really nice exhibit that shows you the importance of jazz in America it's very cool they got a lot of great stuff where you can learn you can see really cool like instruments look at this beautiful piano Wow! I can only play one tune I can't play any tune <laughs> so you beat me there the soul of jazz and American adventure takes visitors on a musical tour across America showcasing the colorful and surprising history of jazz it's Disneyland So this exhibit was actually first in Epcot and they brought it here, so that's really cool. If you want to check it out, come over to Downtown Disney, see it for yourself. I kind of want to try this Brez Nashville hot chicken. You want to try the hot chicken, Janelle? Yeah, it looks delicious. <laughs> You've been wanting chicken tenders for the longest yes, time. Yes, I so. wanted some from the park, but then we stopped by this little area. I'm like, wait, there's chicken here too. <laughs> We're here now, so you might as well get it. Yay. Nashville hot chicken. Batter up. You can even choose like the spiciness. They have wimpy, mild, medium, spicy, dare, and double dare. Oh no. I don't uh, know, I'm not doing double dare. I think I'm just yeah. too mild. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'd be able to. My mouth would be on fire pretty much the whole yeah, day. Yeah, like why ruin your whole experience? You I know? have to have some milk on me if I wanted to do that. It's probably just like for like a gag or something, you know, like, here you go. <laughs> like in Dumb and Dumber where they gave the, the, the peppers <laughs> to that one guy in his burger? Yeah. It was just a goo. I think I'm going to do mild, the kiss of heat. All right, so if you're coming here, you have to order through, uh, it looks like a screen here. I'm going to get the three-piece chicken with fries. That sounds good. What do you want for your side? Fries. All right, so I didn't want to go with the wimpy, so I ended up getting the, <laughs> the medium. I got the... What did I get? I already forgot. I, I got think you mild. Got wimpy. <laughs> I got no. I got mild. Oh, I, got I was mild? gonna go wimpy, but I went with mild. I want a kiss of heat. Yeah. But you guys, it looks really and it smells really good too. It smells really good. So and we got lemonade too. Yes. Mm -mm. So Janelle ordered our food. She put my phone number. I got the text, and it's telling us that our food is gonna be ready in about 40 minutes. 40 minutes, guys. Wow. So that means the food better be good or a lot of people are ordering it and it's it's very popular so i guess in the meantime we're gonna walk around check out some things and then we'll come back and pick up our food wow 40 minutes <laughs> Finding Nemo submarine. This is so cute. It's really cool. And they also have these Thor Love. Oh, what is it? They got Thor Love of Thunder pins as well. Wow. And right now Hercules celebrating 25 years. They also have this really cool pin. What's the price it looks of that? Like it's uh, 1989, but it looks like one of those metal, like Olympic metal things. Oh you yeah, know? you're right. <laughs> How cute. We also have this one too. This one is 1799. Wow, and the price of the Thor Love and Thunder pins are 20 bucks also, $19.99. These are so cool. 
cool. It's a busy day today here at Downtown Disney. Very lively too. I know, but I'm gonna get like beignets, so I'm gonna check out the line. If it's too long, we won't get beignets. If it's, too, if it's short, we're getting beignets. All right, we'll check it out. <laughs> Man, they purposely make you get the beignets. You can smell it from across the other side of Downtown <laughs> yeah. Disney. I like it's just right in the middle. <laughs> I know. <laughs> All right, you got them. There she goes. They're nice and toasty. Yeah. They're nice and toasty. Sorry, I was really close to the camera. Now, these are the best beignets you can hear at Downtown Disney. Honestly, I think they're a little better than the ones inside Disneyland, but you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> Lately, I'm going to agree with you. I'm going to say yes. They're very good. Yes. Very plump, too. But you got to give them that shake. You got to get all the sugar all over the beignets. I know, they do a good job. Come on, Janelle. <laughs> Got this. There we go. Got nice. It. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's hot. Look at that. It's burning my fingers. Take a bite, Janelle. You got this. Just gonna take a bite. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Nice and fluffy on the mm -hmm. inside. Boink, boink, boink. <laughs> <laughs> You know what's funny? What? I haven't had a chicken tender. I haven't had dinner yet. This is my dinner right here. Well, we gotta wait 40 minutes, you know. Yeah. It's gonna be a while. I think I'm not waiting 40 oh, minutes. Wait, there you go. Your order's ready. Let's go, let's go, let's go. go. Now we're heading back over to the Nashville Chicken. It's a very busy day today here at Downtown Disney. It looks like a lot of people are having fun. And of course, it is the summer, so a lot of kids are out now. They're all here, they're all having fun. The chicken days. <laughs> oh, yeah. But now, I think we're gonna get our chicken, you know. Forget the beignets. We're gonna get our chicken. We're just running back and forth at this point. Hey, it's good exercise, I guess. <laughs> okay, so I think we find a nice spot to eat our delicious food. I just, I just wish you had a table. There's no tables around. I forgot they got rid of all the tables. <laughs> yeah. when that whole area got destroyed. So now we're just, now we're just gonna sit on this beautiful bench overlooking uh, Star Traders. I almost, I almost called it the Rainforest Cafe. It's uh, the Star Wars trading post. <laughs> Good music, good music. Good music right now. This is that the comeback sauce. Comeback sauce. And they give us a few. Oh my goodness. Wow. And some buttermilk dressing. Oh, it's all falling. <laughs> this one's yours. Whoa. Whoa. Those are huge. <laughs> what? That is insane. Whoa. That's going to fill me up. <laughs> <laughs> these are mine. These oh, are the mine. Wow. These are, um, look how big they are, guys. <laughs> They're huge. Man, I really wish we had that table, huh? Whoa. So we got the three piece chicken. Yes, we did. Because I want chicken got. tendies. Yeah. Well, now you got them. Yes. But guys, just be aware that if you're trying to get this food, they do not validate. So just letting you know that it's, it's not something they do here. So that's the only thing. But if you want to validate, of course, you could always get some beignets or you could buy yourself like a nice little shirt or something and they will validate you for a few hours, I believe. Check the website before you come so you know exactly how many hours you can do it while you can validate. I believe they have different validation times for buying merch and buying food. They're different. <laughs> Look at these chicken tenders. Ah, I'm burning my hands. <laughs> my little fingers. Ah. Too hot. Wow. Mm. Guys, if you can smell through the TV or through your phone right now, it would smell amazing. Mm-hmm. Smell a lot of the Cajun spices. Oh my, I don't know what spices they're using for the mild, but that's delicious. It does give a little kick to it, but I like the crispy layer, the juicy chicken on the inside. Oh my gosh. Mmm. Oh yeah. You can't wait to dig this into the comeback sauce. Let's do that now, actually. Oh. There you go. Ooh, ha. Huh. Oh my gosh. The comeback sauce is a must. That, like, it brought out all the flavors. Mmm. You can't toast down the spiciness too though. But, oh, but you know what? Mm. I forgot that they do have tables over there by the picnic area by Disneyland. So you're trying to tell me that we have to walk from here all the way over there? Uh, I guess so. Oh. <laughs> no. Now if you guys do want to get this food, <laughs> it's $16 each. So it's not too bad considering all the stuff they give you. The chicken wings are huge. Trust me, you will get full. And it's very tasty. Yeah, the drinks not included. I'm just holding it because it's just their sweet honey tea. I got myself a freshly squeezed lemonade. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Cheers, you know. That's really good. Mm. Mm, mm. That's a really good sweet tea. Oh. Guys, I can 
And by the way, if you guys are looking for a place to eat, you want to sit down somewhere, well, they have this little picnic area where you can come and just sit down, relax, get some food. And it's right next to the entrance of Disneyland. Yeah, just come down, sit down, <laughs> relax, enjoy a drink, or enjoy your food. <laughs> Either one. Today's a grad night. So as you guys can see, whew, a lot of people getting ready to come into Disneyland because soon California Adventure will be closing and all the graduates will be going over to California Adventure and, <laughs> and having a party. party. <laughs> now there's a lot going on here at Disneyland and Disney's California Adventure. If you haven't seen our last video, but the last two should I say, we just did one where Fantasmic returns. We, should, we took you to the Riverbell Terrace so you can see their dining package. And we also showed you some of the new foods they're gonna have here for this summer. So, and that's both parks, Disneyland and Disney's California Adventure. If you haven't seen them, Go check them out. <laughs> now, out of everyone watching these videos, I want to know, when you come to downtown Disney, like, what do you guys, what do you do? Like, what's your favorite thing to do here at downtown Disney? Do you come for the food? Do you come and check out the shops? Or do you just like to hang out? Let me know in the comments below. You know where we should go? Where? The World of Disney. Let's go. Let's go. World of Disney Store. It's been a while since we've been in there, so let's go. Yes, I heard there's some new merch, so I want to check that out, too. Oh, they have a new remote. It's Marie. Look, it's Marie. New arrivals. What's your favorite character of all time? I'm gonna take her. This one. Oh, she's so tiny. She's so cute. It's a little Marie new emo. In the poser like this. <laughs> Twins, I think. If you guys aren't familiar with new emos, we actually made a video about them, so you can check that one out too. So basically, these little little pals like this, you can dress them up as you want it, and they come out with like the cutest outfits. Look at this one, this is my favorite, like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys can customize your new email however you like. So you just buy whatever figure you like. Like if you like Mickey, you can get yourself a Mickey. You can get a mini. Little outfits like this. Mini. Yeah, Marie. You can make them look like this. So just in case you don't know what new emos are, they're getting pretty popular here in the parks. And people usually put them like on their backpacks or they'll carry them like on like their pockets or something. <laughs> Maybe they have like little accessories like backpacks, umbrellas. Little laptops, little food, like this. See? There you go. <laughs> Like if you're really into Disney merch, the World of Disney Store is honestly one of the best places to come where you can find awesome shirts, you can find Mickey mini ears, you can also find toys, and of course, new emos. But there's a lot of things you can come over here and check out for yourself. And let me tell you, sometimes when I come in here, I get scared because I know I have to come out with something. Always. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I got my Marie. <laughs> I got this cute outfit for her. Look, I just found this really cute shirt. It says totally Mickey Mouse, but I love the pastels on here. Look how adorable that is. Wow. So cute. And I don't keep saying cute a lot, but that's just because that's the only word I can think of right now because everything is so cute. What's and the it's $36.99. $36.99. Look, expensive. they also have these really cool bags that match. <laughs> Little lounge flies here. Very nice. And these are, I'm pretty sure about $85. Wow, look at these lounge flies. $75 for this awesome lounge fly. It's the Incredibles. Incredibles. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> dun, 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 dun. It's so cool. Man, I could really go for a num num cookie now. Oh, I know. A warm toasted num num cookie. Yummy. I got a lot of these. If you're an Incredibles fans. I got you covered. <laughs> what? It lights up. This is when I'm, this is a nightlight, but I'm using it when I'm angry, you know? Or like, I'm happy. And I'm really mad at you. And then I'm semi mad, or I'm just very confused. <laughs> so it gets brighter or dark. <laughs> it has a dimming function too, right? <laughs> yeah, look, brighter, dimmer. <laughs> I'm, this one. This one is $27.99 for this $27 little one here. $27.99. So if you want to keep your room lit at night, well... Or you can literally just walk around like this. That's another way too. <laughs> so you can express yourself how angry or mad you are, you know, or how happy you are. <laughs> now look what I just saw right over here, guys. Snakes. Why do they have to be snakes? <laughs> 
I really want to get this hat. Now, this is brand new. This one is $29.99. I like the fact that it looks a little worn out, even though it's not. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, but on the All inside, right. like... Indiana Jones. <laughs> I like the little logo on here. It has like his hat and his whip right there in the corner. Yeah, right? And I love hats and I love Indiana Jones. So I think I'm going to have to take it home. <laughs> I think so. I think it needs to come home. Oh no. <laughs> Check out this mug. Reach for the sky. <laughs> $14.99. If anyone knows what movie that's from, let me know in the comments below. Look at this. They have a Metal Earth Disneyland sign, the main entrance sign. But all of us 90s kids know about this. How much was it? $21.99. $21? Yes. $1.99. I think I might take it. I don't know. Should I? Uh, I feel like, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I won't work on it. <laughs> it'll just be there and it'll be like, oh, I'll do it later. I'll do it later. I'll never do it. And I feel like we bought something like this before. Have we? Yeah. I have a feeling we have something like, we just never built it. Huh. But we have it in storage somewhere. I know I remember purchasing something like this. I gotta start looking. We got unless so we much probably, stuff Unless you like the wooden one. Remember that like a wooden piece this one? I think this so. This is metal. Wow. Well, that's still cool though. I'm excited. <laughs> Does she fit in there? Let's see. Disney always doing the most with their tags, huh? Like... The CVS tag. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna snip that off when we get home, but how cute. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Another Lizzie McGuire shirt. Do you like it? Lizzie McGuire, you're an outfit for Peter. Her little clothes on here. These are the clothes I chose for her. What's that? It's like a little shirt, puffy sleeves, and a mini skirt. But I'm just realizing now that, like, how am I supposed to, like, rip this? Oh, never mind. That was easy. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, never mind. That was easy. I got this cute little two-piece set. Look. So it's like, it, a, like fishing? A, no, like little birds, I think. Little birds, and it's almost like a little puff sleeve shirt, a little mini skirt. And I love the vest. The vest corset top. Okay, I'm going to dress up. <laughs> I feel like a child again. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I already like it. Look how cute she looks. <laughs> oh, she's so tiny. She's so cute. This is something I would wear with the skirt and like the little top. There we go. Hold on. There we go. She looks good. She's so cute. Hi. And I could take her with you on your backpack. Yes. She's so tiny. Yeah, so if you guys ever want to get yourself a new emu, new emu, Nemo. <laughs> new emo, well, They're get so them here cute. at World of Disney, right over yeah. there. And uh, yeah, they have so many different characters. I just can't wait to snap these off of her. Who do we have now? We have Kermit. We, we have, have Kermit. We have Orange Bird. We have Orange Bird. We have Kermit. We have Minnie Mouse and Mickey Mouse. Which is mine. Mickey is mine. And Minnie is mine. And yeah. now we have. Oh, and I have Donald too. It's my favorite. You have Donald? Yeah, I have Donald. Oh, I have Donald too. <laughs> I'm trying to remember who we have. Oh, and we also have Marie now. I have Marie. Yeah. <laughs> Taking her little tags in until I get home and cut cut them off. CBS tags. Yes. So I'm taking them under her shirt, like, but it seems to work. Look. Yeah, that's good. There's a lot of new things happening here at Downtown Disney. For instance, the Jazz Kitchen is going to get a whole new look. They're going to modernize it. Also, the Uva Bar is going to be like that whole area is going to be revamped. And then uh, I believe we're going to get Ding Tai Fung coming in, which I really love. We've been to the one in Vegas. It's delicious, guys. They have some great food. So there's a lot of changes coming in. And over there, they have a lot of construction because once they build something new, I'm sure we're all going to be here having a great time. And there's a brand new downtown Disney. That's going to be pretty cool. Man, we had a great time here at Downtown Disney. Now, we wanted to show you guys around what was new. This was just a little short vlog, just so you guys can see for yourselves. We haven't been here for a while. And I got Marie. So cute. And you got your Marie. <laughs> yes. Guys, we just want to say thank you guys. We have more episodes coming your way. This was just a nice little short episode. We just want to say we love you guys. Thank you for watching our videos. But we'll see you guys here next time on, on Magic, Magic Journeys. Journeys. Bye. Bye.